Hey guys. Well, I've mounted the vise back on the uh, Precision Matthews and a couple of problems that I ran into. As I'm going through this, I am I hear random sounds and something that started, it wasn't, this sound didn't happen originally, but it started to kind of creep in and now it's pretty constant. And so I started troubleshooting this sound, but let me let you hear it. Uh, hopefully you can hear this over the fan uh, and you could also hear this in one of my earlier videos when I did the script test you could hear this clicking sound uh, and that's what got me kind of going on this but um, let's let you listen It's not as prevalent going in this direction, but it's still there. In this direction, you can definitely hear it. It's also started to creep in on my Y-axis. So, I started to figure out, well, is it my angular contact bearings that are causing that noise, that clicking sound? Are my ball nuts dry? Uh, I don't really think so. My ball screws are seem to be wet. And so I think lubrication is not the problem. Uh, I started to look into it a little further and I thought, well, maybe there's some misalignment on my coupling and so what I did was I spread this apart a little bit so that the make sure that the two metal surfaces there are not touching there's a gap between this leg here and this leg here that's not the issue but the clicking still the st clicking was still present so to make a long story short I found out what the problem is and the problem is this coupling and and it's the rubber or not rubber it's a hard plastic is making like a oh it moves back and forth a little bit and I guess it's causing a rubbing and I thought it was pretty interesting I, actually that this would make this clicking sound but let me just show you how I figured this out now I use aluminum when I'm cutting aluminum on the X2 I use alcohol to lubricate it and the evaporation of the alcohol also cools it off but you can hear the clicking As you can see, uh, if I put a little lubricant in there, uh, it gets in there and it stops making that noise. So it must be something with this uh, hard plastic right there. Uh, a lot of 
I've used these plum couplings with my X2 and I, I like having the plastic there because it gives it a little shock absorption. Uh, however, I did order some diaphragm type couplings and so I'll give those a shot and we'll see if that takes care of the noise. But as long as I know what the noise is, I'm not too concerned about it and I'm not going to worry too much about it. Likewise, on the on the x-axis the same issue if I spray it in there the noise goes away So, I was really happy to find out that it was something as simple as uh, just those plum couplings rubbing. Now, once I use the meal, that may go away with the plum couplings, I'm not sure. It lasts a little while, but eventually the alcohol just kind of vibrates, I mean, evaporates. But the meal sounds really good. Uh, the axis move really nice. They sound really good. Got no complaints. I've been out here running the meal uh, with these uh, setting up the backlash and all that. And I, I mean, I've had this thing powered on for hours, and the stepper motors that are just holding that I'm not using, they don't even get warm. And the one that I'm using going back and forth gets a little warm. But other than that, they haven't ran hot yet. I won't really know until I actually start running some code, but pretty impressed with the. Uh, coolness of these three-phase stepper motors so sounds of the meal and uh, if you ever run into this situation where you got that clicking sound uh, it may not be what you think so it's always good to investigate and check it out and now that I know exactly what the problem is uh, and it is the plum couplings I'm really relieved and so I'm not going to be too concerned about it so that wraps up this video. Just a quick tip, something I wanted to share. If you have any suggestions or questions, please feel free to comment. Thumbs up if you like the video. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe and most importantly, be safe.